Hi, Peggy from Countryside here. Today we're going to talk about Spathophyllum, otherwise known as peace lilies. The things I like about these plants, there's two things I like about them. One, they're great beginner plants. So if you're just getting into having house plants, this is a good plant to start with. The second thing is these are one of the best plants that um, clear the air in your house. So they're really, really good for that. So that's another plus. If you get one of these plants, while they do tolerate low light, they do kind of like a bright indirect for at least four hours a day. This will encourage them to shoot some blooms. As far as watering goes, during the growing period, they like to stay evenly moist. Not real soggy, but if you water them about once a week, that should be good. In the winter, you can cut back to like two times a week. Also, you don't want this plant to get so dry that it flags or it droops. Because if you get in the habit of letting it flag and then watering it and back and forth and back and forth, it stresses the plant out. You can end up with brown tips on the end of the leaves. For fertilizer during the growing period, you want to use a diluted houseplant fertilizer, probably half strength, every other week. They do like to be tied in their pots, so you don't want to be transplanting too much, but you'll know when it's ready to transplant. If you notice when you water your plant and it's a short period of time before the plant starts drooping, it's probably time then to put it in a bigger pot. Um, unfortunately, they are toxic to animals and people, and so you want to keep them out of reach of kids and pets. So um, we do have a nice selection here. I have these eight inch plants here, a six inch, and I have some nice four inch here. So if you know someone that's going to start getting into houseplants and you want to give them a gift, this is a perfect one. Come on in and check out our selection. I'll see you in the greenhouse.